What is going on guys, Ginger here, today for you guys is another Call of Duty Advanced Warfare video and today's video is going to be about how to get a higher KD and uh, kind of what to play, what to do and stuff like that. So, yeah, the first thing obviously is the game mode I'm playing right now, Infected, you guys can get a high KD and win-loss playing this game uh, very easily, very quickly, but it's not really 100% legit. What I mean by that is Infected is not hard to play, uh, a little kid could play it and probably end up with a high KD because you average at least uh, this game maybe at least like three to one kill death ratio uh, maybe or maybe in like uh, cod ghost you would average like 10 to a one kill the de kill death ratio so by doing this you'll have good games you'll have bad games and uh, even a bad game will end up in a positive KD most likely unless you're infected first then you're screwed but I mean it happens um so yeah infected is a good way to go because again uh, easy, easy way to get kills. Uh, you don't die too much unless you get infected. And uh, your win-loss goes up very easily because, uh, like, really, when do you lose a game of infected? But, I mean, uh, yeah. So that's pretty much one way that you guys could do it. Another way is just, you guys got to find your gun. Like, if you guys are playing online, multiplayer uh, game modes, you got to find your gun that you, that you like and that you're good at. Like, even if, like, um, say you get the gun... Fully mag you get the diamond for it, and so you want to move on to a different gun. I don't know if you, I would do that if I were you, just because you know you got to stay good with the guns that you, that you're good at, so uh, you guys can actually get kills and you know how the gun works and all that good stuff. Um, so yeah, that's about it for that. A game mode to play that you could probably keep a pretty good KD ratio and maybe uh, just positive. That's all I'm really going for here: positive KD, so 1.0, 2.0, whatever. Uh, would probably be Hardpoint or Domination Momentum, any of those because they're objective game modes and what that means is that uh, the enemy team and your team are all going to one, uh, particularly one location unless you're playing Momentum where you guys are all going one location pretty much for sure, like Domination it could be one of three. So say you're playing Domination, you can't have the B flag the whole game, um, you'll be getting a lot of kills because everybody wants that flag. Uh, so, yeah, play the objective. That's a really, really good tip. It's about what I could give you guys. And, um, yeah, so another one would be, uh, this is just kind of a tip you guys could do. This one won't really help you in kills, but this will help you in your deaths to get less of them. And take advantage of the exosuit. So what I mean by that is not the abilities at all, because uh, you're not very good in this game, but the exosuit as in the double jumping or... Just jumping over a really tall wall after you're getting chased, like you're getting shot at, trying to regen health. Just jump over a big wall and stuff like that. Um, that's what I mean by that. Just stay high. Um, don't be always on the ground, low or even like really low, or always running. Um, that's why if you guys are play, if you guys do play infected, you'll see. I feel like one of the last three people, you'll always be jumping and jumping and jumping. And what is that? What uh, what happens to that guy that keeps jumping? He doesn't die for fair amount of time so uh yeah take advantage of the exo suit and one last tip i have for you guys that would help is just use the right perks and just class setup and all so use suppressor uh if you like it and if you're good with it uh because that helps a lot stays off the radar staying off the radar is a huge thing to keep your kd high uh play the game what you like just play whatever you guys like get used to it and all that stuff um uh, use blind eye use like the off the radar all that stuff just to stay off the radar that's a huge huge thing and that's the last tip i'm going to give you guys for today so thank you guys for watching if you have enjoyed in any way shape or form if this has helped you please leave a like and subscribe for more daily call of duty advanced warfare content and with that said guys i'll see you in the next one peace out